Centurion's Photon Infrared Gate Safety Beams provide a means for you to achieve maximum automated gate safety in the minimum amount of time with minimum of effort. In this demonstration, we'll be showing you just how quick and easy it is to get the set up and running. The first thing that you'll notice is that the transmitter is completely wireless. If you remove the cover, which unclips very easily, you'll see that the module is powered by two AA batteries. The other thing you'll notice is that it has a little jumper inside, and when it comes out of the box, the jumper is bridging the off pins. You can take the little jumper and place it on the on pins. You'll hear a short confirmation beep indicating that the photon is now on. The beauty of it being wireless is that it can be mounted without having to dig or tunnel under your driveway, incurring labor costs and defacing your property. The receiver, which is this module over here, will be mounted on the side of the driveway closest to the gate motor and is simply wired to the operator's controller. The first thing that you'll notice when you open the receiver cover is that it has a little white push button. The push button is used to put the unit into installer mode and also to reset the battery low condition state. To get into installer mode, simply press and hold this push button over here for 2 seconds. And note that this is done on the receiver side as this is the side that needs to align. The two beeps you just heard means that the unit is now in installer mode. Also notice that the LED over here has just come on. It's always important to remember to put the lens covers back on when aligning the beams. Another great feature of Photon is how much freedom of movement it gives you, not only due to there being no restrictive wiring on the transmitter side, but also because it casts such a wide beam. What you're hearing now is the 4 kHz tone from the receiver telling us that we have alignment. Just have a look at how much we can actually move the transmitter before we lose alignment. The last thing we'd like to show is how easy photon beams are to mount compared to other beams. There is a mounting hole in the PC board, as you can see here, which corresponds to an opening in the enclosure, so there is no need to remove the electronics when mounting. Simply place the screw into the hole and mount the unit. <laughs> 